This is an Excel dashboard and we can see we've got total revenue with a forecast to the end of the year and below it we're looking at the top 10 products and we can see the biggest contributing product is actually performing bad and getting worse. We can also look at our customers but our top customer is performing great and even getting better. And we can look at our employees, in this case we're seeing sales reps. If we look at something like territory, we notice that um, the contribution is spread out and it's all pretty flat, so nothing too interesting to see there. If we look at brand, nothing terribly interesting. But if we look at size, something jumps off the screen. We're losing money for small products. So let's isolate small products. And now we can flip back to products, so we can see all of the products. We notice that two of them are actually making money, so let's look at those two products, 2S and 8S. And we notice that they're coming from brand Y. So if we remove brand Y, we're left with all of our products that are losing money. So we can see which customers are buying them. We can see which reps are selling them. We probably need to have a chat with rep number eight. If we want to, we can go into a playground where we can actually use the pivot table and make any kind of reports that we want. Or we could go and look at the raw data and see how all of this information has come together. That's it for this Excel dashboard. Um, there's no macros, no Visual Basic, and no third-party plugins. Just pure Excel, and it's using version Excel 2010. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.